Okay, this is a $7,000 microscope workout. You won't see top-of-the-line equipment like this in the average classroom. We talked a little bit about those cells that make the glue, right? Mm -hmm. But the glue that holds you together. This stuff is made of that same glue. So give, try, give this a try. And the teachers here are world-class researchers. The RBC Youth Biolab is a new facility at the St. Boniface Hospital Research Center. Students get to work under the instruction of leading medical researchers inside a state-of-the-art facility. In the classroom, we don't like usually uh, learn really specific stuff about heart, but uh, in here we learned uh, like about uh, how does a cell works and like how does a cell uh, looks and stuff, and the different chemicals and stuff. So um, yeah, we learn specific things over here than in the classroom. Today, these grades seven and eight students from Victor Major School are learning about the heart. Art. Youth Biolab teaching liaison Steve Jones is introducing them to cell structure and guiding them through a pig heart dissection. I thought I'd be really freaked out, but at the end, I'm the one that touches it the most, so it's, it's not too scary. The Biolab connects classroom curriculum to current medical research. Students from grades 5 through 12 experience science through hands-on activities. That's the part I say all the time too, is I've probably dissected you know, 50,000 of these pig hearts over the years, but that's what you really get to see in kids, is that level of engagement, and if you can spark that curiosity, like that's really what science is all about, right? Is if we can get kids asking questions. So the first question you can ask yourself, do you think this is bigger or smaller than your hearts? Along with encouraging students to ask questions, Joan stresses the importance of healthy living through his science lessons. You can picture this next time you go to McDonald's. Here's a tube with 52 grams of fat in it, okay? So that's how much fat's in a Big Mac and fries right there. Today's pig heart dissection is aimed at teaching students about cardiovascular disease. All these kids, you, me, everybody, has some connection to heart disease. One in three Canadian deaths is heart disease. So if we can give kids a bit of a perspective on the science behind that disease, then maybe they can start understanding these things like, oh, I shouldn't be smoking and eating this, and I should be exercising. Why do we need to do all those things? Show them a bit of the science, and hopefully, you know, maybe we can affect health outcomes down the road too. These Victor Major students are one of the first group of students to work in the bio lab since it opened last week, and another 4,500 students are expected to come through here within the next year. For Go Winnipeg, I'm Jessica Cable.